Why was I just Irish? That was weird. Today is the first morning in quite a while that I've actually vlogged in the morning. It's 8.30 on Saturday. I have my coffee and I'm up, unfortunately, but I do need to do some grocery shopping after I get all these YouTube comments replied to and hopefully I can fix something on here. It was brought to my attention by one of our loyal subscribers, Hannah M, that I showed Calvin in the bathtub and where most of you probably don't care because he's a little boy and nobody looks at little boys that way. Okay, I shouldn't say that. Most people don't look at little boys that way. Um, I do always try to cover him up because it is YouTube's policy and I don't want that one random different person to see Calvin and watch our videos for that reason. So I'm gonna try to fix it on the YouTube editor, but I've never actually done that before. So hopefully it works. I will let you know if it does or if it doesn't because everything I've heard is that it probably won't. <laughs> so I'm hoping otherwise, but I, uh, I'll let you know. 20 minutes later and I think I figured out how to fix it. It's just gonna take a long time for that edit to process. It says edit in progress right now and I don't know how long that's gonna take but hopefully not too long because I'm gonna go hop in the shower and then I need to do some stuff with this afterwards so hopefully it can hurry back up. Calvin and I are on our way to the farmer's market. We're gonna go to this JA near our house as well as the banana stand if the JA doesn't have all the fruit we need because the JA pretty much has mostly vegetables a lot of cabbage, a lot of green. They don't have as much fruit. And the banana stand has mostly fruit. So we're gonna go here and see if they have everything we need. If not, we'll head over there too. But we just passed this old building that used to be like a slots, pachinko, gambling type place. You think of places that are like graffitied or tagged with spray paint artwork. You wouldn't think of like a main street in Japan. You think of like, I don't wanna say ghetto, but not as nice of areas like in the States. But here it's kind of common to have like more populated areas being tagged. Oh, thank you for letting me in. That was so nice of you. <laughs> Why was I just Irish? That was weird. But this building I always notice. I don't know why I just always notice this one building and I'm like, why is it like that? I don't understand. But it's stupid. I don't know why I even mentioned it. I just had to throw it out there that this is what I see all the time and a lot of people think very differently of Okinawa and Japan and like have this idea of what it looks like here, but it's just like anywhere else really. The only difference is all of the roofs are flat. <laughs> I miss arched roofs and actually this JA that I'm at right now has an arched roof and I'm like I'm home What are you looking at? They had just about everything we needed except for apples and pineapple We eat a lot of apples lately. We eat apples with peanut butter and almond butter and they didn't really have many Ugh. It was so busy though. I don't know why, I don't know what's going on. I think right outside here, they have boxes of carrots and potatoes and oranges and some sort of leafy green. And I believe the sign says as many as you can fit in a bag for whatever price is there because people are just stuffing their bags full of carrots. And I'm like, holy moly. Inside they had bags of asparagus, like a little tiny bag for like 320 yen, which, isn't really that bad for here. That's a fairly decent price for here. So I grabbed one of those and we grabbed some green beans. I grabbed some of the small little red potatoes because we don't really have red potatoes at the commissary and I've been looking for some 
So let's go to the banana stand and see if they have what we need. Oh, a watermelon? Yeah. Oh, they had small watermelons for 800 yen and Calvin wanted one, but I said maybe we can find some that's cut up because I don't think they're quite in season yet, so I don't really want to buy one if they're not completely ripe or ready. I'd rather wait or buy like a small pack for him. That's what he's mad about, because he wanted watermelon. I'm sorry. I love you. This intersection we're at is so interesting to me because there's one, two, three different directions that people are allowed to come from, and ours is kind of like a yield, go when you can, and then the other two ways are like green light. It's so interesting. I'm gonna see if I can get it, but it's kind of hard to understand what's happening because we're going at like an angle. That truck is coming from the main street and then those people right over there are from the main road. So I need to go this way. Isn't that weird? Are you sleeping? <laughs> are you sleeping now? <laughs> Already? <laughs> I have been cleaning the house like crazy this morning. <sighs> and FaceTiming with McKenna and we went and got some produce. But the most important thing here is that we have a package at the post office. So it's 2.15ish and the radio is still kind of loud. And we're here to pick up a package. And I'm hoping it's my Maurice's stuff, but it could just be another part that Travis ordered and then I'm gonna be disappointed. Calvin was sleeping and I kept asking if he was sleeping or if he was awake and he was smiling and it was really cute. But I think he's actually asleep now. Are you actually asleep now? Calvin, are you sleeping? No. <laughs> You're a good baker, I love you. You can go to sleep. But Stephanie messaged me as well and said that um, they're going down to Naha to get something at Toys R Us for Cam and then they'll be back later but they probably won't be back by 3 and that was when we were going to go to their house so Travis may or may not be at work by the time they get home and we head over there I don't really know hopefully my stuff is here huh. I can't even tell where he's at in life. are you kidding me what Calvin fell asleep on our way home. So I just laid him on the couch when we got home and then I was working on videos because Travis was outside working on his car. And he started whining so I got up and came out here and he had to pee. So he got up and went pee. And while he was in the bathroom, I went and sat back down at our computer. He came and laid himself back on the couch. Sort of. <laughs> He's asleep. He's asleep. This place should look awfully familiar. We just got to Good's house for Cam's birthday. It's quarter after four, so Travis is already in uniform because he's just gonna have to go to work in like 30 minutes anyways. Are you excited to see your friends? Yeah, it's this one right here. That see, door. push it a bunch of times. So good on you. Look at you. <laughs> yeah. How cool is that? Ah! 
boys get pizza because they're disgusting. And we're having burgers. Mmm. Thanks, pickle. Kyle. You're welcome. I want pickles. We're all done eating, so now it's time for cake. cake. Stephanie made a Lego cake. <laughs> Pinterest for the win. What are these? Chocolate? Just dyed chocolate molds and then I bought those things on Amazon. You're a genius. Are you ready? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Welcome out. Chocolate Lego Man. Done. Marvel. Okay. Looks so good. Whoa! Whoa! He's like, okay, what else is in there? <laughs> they have to open everything and then decide what they want. Baby boy asked me to come and lay with him, so come and lay with him, I shall. What are we watching? Octonauts. You love Octonauts? Mm -hmm. Ziki's got a bone. Ziki's got a bone. It's a really big one. Yeah. I laid down in bed and I realized, holy moly, I didn't end the vlog. It just hit midnight. Would you look at that? I was already so comfortable laying in bed. I didn't want to get up, but I'm dedicated. I got you guys. Calvin wanted me to lay on the couch with him, like I had said, and he ended up falling asleep. So I took him in, laid him down, and then I was watching the new episode of Catfish while I did a workout. And then I went and got him up and took him to the bathroom so he would go pee because I didn't want him to pee in his bed. I don't want him to come in in like three hours and be crying because he peed in his bed. I would rather just wake him up a little bit, take him potty, and have him go back to sleep. It's so much easier. But on that note, I'm gonna head to bed. So for now, that is that, and we will see you when we see you. Bye! You look as beautiful as ever And I swear that every day you'll get better You make me feel this way somehow I'm so in love with you And I hope you know Oh, old people in Japan. You're so silly.